for the second straight week. St. Louis face a team 14th in their respective conference. Last week, two early goals. Just to help be brave to get on the ball to provide that leadership. Well, that's given away in a dinner and quick to seize on it. And those are the kind of mistakes that Toronto could well do without. Definitely far more comfortable standing here today than I was in March, <laughs> I can tell you that. You were wearing a two that day. A woolly hat. Now it's Jackson. And he sets up Joe Keeney. And Romero's forced into the game's first real save. Jackson as he steps around Mubika for the centre back needs to be winning that challenge. The step out is far too easy. We'll come back to AZ Jackson in a moment. And more of what Bradley Carno said about a player who's already been scouted by several clubs in Germany. Marshall Ruddy's cross and they had it down and into the ground from Akinola. His last goal came in September last year. Losing the ball, Toronto FC keeping them on the front foot. Marshall Ruddy against Watts, he's got round him and that cross is going to bring its way all the way over the far side where the shot will be drilled wide. Tips it over for a corner. In swinger from the fullback on that far side of the field, but he actually goes short for Sylvania. Now they change the angle, and it's hung up where Berkey comes to get it. Only punch, Marshall Ruddy hits it back, and straight at Berkey. The whole roster, there are a series of players, of course, on the bench tonight have been called up from TFC2, just for so short of numbers. Continuity would aid them, players who've come through early, as this will be the game's first yellow card. So, Ayo Akinola. Scored early from a corner last week against Colorado, remember? This, their first of the game. Return in and just over! Aziel Jackson. Returning that with some interest. Corner drop in as the ball comes out to Jackson. So great confidence, isn't it? That's a good layoff for a dinner in from Joachini, and that's a good save from Romero. He'll need some help. He gets it from Petretto, who clears it away. What a big moment that is for Romero. Romero's MLS debut for Toronto tonight. For Toronto FC, that's terrible defending. Two center backs going for the same ball as a dinner in. CJ Sapong, last man out of the tunnel and trotting onto the field, and we are underway for the second half from BMO Field. A goalless game between a Toronto side. It's a cool night now. <laughs> Mark Anthony Kay, a Toronto man, winning it for the home team. Caribbean Heritage Night tonight, that's why they're in the pink and blue special kits. Yellow card issued quickly to that's Tim Parker. An interesting one there. Turn. Kerr's made the run, Sapong dangerous in the middle, but he's peeled it all the way back. And Marshall Rutty hits it wide. It's good moving and DeAndre Kerr getting it behind. Floating in behind them. This is Joe Keeney. Yeah, this is going to come through to Jackson again. He's on his left and he scores his first goal in Major League Soccer. And St. Louis take the lead at BMO Field. In this situation, it's Toronto FC. The two lackluster in clearing the ball, clearing the danger, and how quickly a kill watch pounces on the ball. Gets on the ball and he finds Jackson just popping up in a nice little pocket. Twist and turns so well in the tight space. And how quickly he gets himself in towards the center of the goal and then he comes back towards that near stick. Just calmly and coolly finds the back of the net. In Toronto and Terry Dunfield side now had to battle back and they tried to do so in the Sylvania. He finds Akinola, Berkey with the save. Falls to Kerr. Reserves a newly won lead from this man, Jackson, for Stroud.
and Stroud hits it from an acute angle, just rising, and over the top for the goal kick. Speed, Holmes, we'll get under this one, and a flick on for Denner, and then it's one again to drop for on to hit it, straight at Romero, and we'll drive from here on the eastern side of Toronto. Canada, I should say, as Pompeo seizes on this. It's Celio Pompeo. He's only just on the field. He's produced a great save. Thomas Romero keeps his side in the game. His first call to action gives the ball away to Pompeo, who dips, just tracks the ball nicely. Blum wins it. And he keeps it. And St. Louis can surely see the game out on that far side of the field now as we go beyond the three minutes. And there'll be a booking as well. And it's all over. St. Louis, sensational. Another victory for the expansion side. They go on the road. And Aziel Jackson's first goal in Major League Soccer gives them all three points.